Oh well. It's been a while. Now things are getting more convenient nowadays, yeah? You can screen record with a normal phone that you could have. has a mic recording feature, which is pretty nice too. Yeah, this is probably not um, pen spinning related really. Just a little update that I just felt like doing because I didn't know there was a screen recording feature to this phone. In terms of update, there isn't really much to tell, to be honest. It's almost um, job hunting season for me. Just finding a lot of options I could do, because it seems like academic inflation is a real thing. In terms of spinning though, um, Yeah, it's obvious that I'm not that committed anymore. Initially, I would like to say I was, but I guess there is no excuse to not. Just very irresponsible right now. Feels bad, but... I'd like to say I gave my best, uh, if I can. I still post um, a quiet amount of videos on Twitter, but none that um, on YouTube or anything, usually because my computer, my PC, broke down because it spilled some alcohol on me, but that's a different story. And ever since I can't really record anything, I still have my MacBook, but, you know, MacBook are shit in terms of um, recording Pennsylvania videos. So... Trying to get a part-time job right now, so I can get a stable uh, money source. And then while uh, managing all the other stuff I need to spend for my utilities and also, like food and all, maybe we could save a little portion from time to time to replace for a new computer that finally I could um, buy buy a computer for myself then edit some videos try to keep the community active which I told myself I would do for the past two years but <laughs> look at how it is right now I have been thinking though, there is, um, I feel like there is a way to not only just restore pen spinning activity, but um, try to stabilize his activity. But 
obviously there is always like steps um, members of the community that need to follow and I mean like um, everyone internationally speaking this needs to be like a group sort of understanding in order for this to work and the concept is really easy though it's something that a lot of um, manipulative arts communities have been doing but we haven't because I don't know actually have we now I think of it Back in the days in 2005 or 6, during Zombo ages, maybe they have done it. I'm not quite so sure. But as the years pass by, you do notice how um, the modern team, well, there is a lack of, um, of a, an authoritative entity in the community that sort of regulates whole events and all that events as well as um, information now that everyone is on the internet technically making pen spinning pervasive on the internet shouldn't be like a very difficult thing it's just that there's not a lot of people who are willing to put the amount of effort and obviously, that's because of um, the lack of incentives. There is no um, anything, any reward other than, you know, sentiments of certain things, like certain emotions and gratitude from some, barely some spinners. I mean, I don't know. To be honest, um, recognition in the internet is kind of a high incentive already, at least in this generation, which is why people want likes, retweets, shares, and uh, posts, reposts, and all that. But the community is so separated that it can't generate enough of these... um, what do you call those likes and shares and all that? Let's just get. Let's just call the brownie points. It doesn't generate a, satisfac- a satisfactory amount of those points in order to satisfy a person, which makes it more difficult for a person to become more engaged in the whole community. I guess outlets like um, Reddit is pretty useful in that case. Not only because. Um, because of the features that Reddit can offer, but it's also because um, it's close to what everyone uses pretty much every day. A lot of people are using Reddit nowadays, I feel like, especially those who could, who are familiar with English or so, as well as Twitter too. Japan, in that sense, is doing pretty well, but I guess geography is also a factor for that sort of stable activity. New spinners constantly come in and all that. Hmm. What should I do? already done everything I could do actually UPSBT though right <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm really sorry um, I still have the, the rule book right in my computer if any I'll just I'll try to give it to the judges have them approve it and then um, post it 
on UPSB, then try to make the UPSB active again. Oh god. That doesn't sound promising at all, doesn't it? Well... As you can see, it's like 3.30 a.m. in the morning right now, so I'm not really sure what I'm saying at this point. Maybe blabber out some other stuff. Oh, by the way, that new collab, you guys seen it? Yeah, this thing. It's not recent. <laughs> Yeah, since it's recording on mic, it's... Uh, oh, wow, it's glitching. Yeah. Since it's recording, it's going to sound terrible. Like, all the noises and all that. Yeah, it's a recent clone. Apparently, it's really big. I've talked to the editor. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, he couldn't really sleep much. Because of this. Yeah, I mean, look at the edit. I mean, does it honestly take that much time and effort in order to do that? But then again, that might, you know, that's probably really rude to the, to the editor. Looks cool, though. The font's a bit eh, too much, though, to me. Yeah, there's that there, there's that there. It's probably better than Rem REMT or whatever, Rencha. That's what the Japanese people call them, REMT. And then people call this dude, what, Fakro? <laughs> Fakro. It means owl in Japanese, by the way. Yeah, he's just there. Yeah, he isn't there. He's probably the biggest surprise. That's probably the only person, or the only moment I liked about this collab. It's not really something I enjoyed. I didn't enjoy it, but it probably only meant like 20% of my satisfaction. Mm. Yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. Um, well, since this is a really convenient tool, uh, if there's anything, if anything that needs to be talked about, I could probably talk about them on the next video. Just message me casually on email, UPSB, Twitter, Discord, maybe in the comments or so. I guess that's it for now. Alright, see you later.